What the hell just happened? Oh my God, what the fuck did I just watch? Holy shit. That was the, that race was the definition of live in La Vida Loca, like Ricky Martin, written by Robbie Draco Rosa and Desmond Child. <laughs> Even as, even though Noah got crashed and I was, I was kind of ticked at first, you know, the fact that the whole rest of the race outside of that was just a hot caca crash em all derby all night long kind of made up for it. So we weren't the only ones to get crashed. I found it amazing how, like, the cars were taking heavy, heavy licks. Most of them were, at least. Not all of them. And yet they were still trucking along like nothing happened. Like, they were clean as a whistle. Can Winston Cup be like this tomorrow night? But when I go to my dad's crib, even if he would allow me to scream, which we all know he's not going to because he's now used to doing things his way compared to when I was growing up a kid in a teen on Lenore and Sandhurst. But, oh my God. I mean, even if he would let me, even if he didn't care that I scream, I really, yeah, I can't eat or either way. He goes, the fucking dogs, loot I'm Bo will go crazy. Oh my God! It's, it's tomorrow. I mean, tonight we got the wreck. We got the wreck 'em all derby. We got the crash 'em all derby. We got the fucking crash 'em all derby. I just hope this uh, is not an indicator tonight that we're gonna get the hot a hot cock a show tomorrow night in Winston Cup. <laughs> wow! No, I had plenty of opportunities to um um get the get that son of a bitch in the fifty four. Now I see why people don't like him, even though. I don't hate or dislike them. My opinion still remains the same. I don't hate Ty Gibbs. I don't dislike him. I'm just not crazy about him. And stuff like this includes exactly why. Sure, he's young and all that, but you don't be you don't be doing dumb, dangerous ass, dangerous ass stuff like that. Especially when you want you want to clock somebody like Bob Barker with your helmet on for what I call booty Barker action from The Price Is Right. Oh, goodness gracious, alive. It's just something tells me it's going to be one of those weekends for season one of Spring is in the Air. I mean, I, Ty Gibbs was already in trouble with NASCAR anyway, so even if all that drama never happened, he was going to the big blue truck no matter what for not slowing down for the caution. Like, you know, they were still racing back like in the old days when I was little. So it goes to show you how old I am, how NASCAR, how far NASCAR has evolved and changing stuff. Uh, you know, compared to like now that I'm 28, considering I was like seven when I started watching. Wow, I mean, I'm, I know people who are, did not like the Craftsman truck race last night because it was a leech infested snooze fest, but I hope this rest, Bush series wreck em all derby kind of made up for it. I mean, wow, we saw a lot of action. I mean, there was so, Dale Jr. wrecked in one of his own cars, and I guess Josh wanted payback, and you know, I know there was a Dale Jr. fan on there that said, I know that was payback, but don't break my heart, because she's probably the most passionate Earnhardt family fan I've ever seen, but, and to think, you know, Hemrick had a quiet night outside of him spinning out and hitting the wall, also getting his tire cut. Riley had a chance. Well, Riley was like, you know, the, in the catbird seat. In case ever enough cars wiped out, he just stormed through and get his first win. But he was, he proved that he is the superior monster energy car tonight. By, you know, even he got past that son of a bitch in the 54 when, you know, Brandon moved his bitch ass out the way. Like, Luda! <laughs> I can't believe it, man. Wow. I mean,. There's really not much to say except that was a definition of a Ricky Martin living La Vida Loca race, all courtesy of Robbie Draco Rosa and Desmond Child. Tomorrow night, I hope we get the same shit, even if it means we can't really go all crazy because of my dad and or his dogs. You know, him doing things his way compared to doing the way things that I, I would like him to do in my favor while all the years we grew up together. But also, happiest of birthdays to my number one on Fox, Jamie Little. I mean, I'm probably going to tag you in the Instagram post late because the tagging glitch got me again. But Twitter, you're going to fucking see everything for sure. I better get off this thing and get ready to pack for my dad for, and like, upload this first impact from my dad's crib tomorrow so it's over thanks for watching see you all tomorrow night at my dad's crib for the winston cup race catch y'all later live in love you loca oh mama